interesting how like there's so many different Christians who worship in different ways and think really deeply about things who can like come to different opinions on the same thing. This is a design to share how perhaps we feel like God's love should be perceived in all communities. No matter what different churches say, the church should be about love and so that's what we're hoping to convey with our presence at Pride TV. This is a time of celebration for the LGBT community. For me, I think I've gone a long time of my life, particularly my life as a believer, without dialoguing about the issues. I think this is a good time for me to go as a student. Yeah, so we are at Pride uh, because we really care about the gay community and we know that uh, churches and Christians a lot of times tend to speak hate even if it's accidentally to this community. So we want to communicate a different message, not just that, that God loves our gay friends, but also um, that as Christians, we've hurt that community, even if it's accidentally, and so we want to say sorry too, that um, we need your forgiveness, that we've probably hurt you, churches have often hurt the gay community, so um, that's why we're here, to share love and ask for forgiveness. This is about equality, not necessarily any religion. Nice to see that people are saying that this is not what like Christianity is about. It's not about hating people because of who they are. It's about accepting each other. So I'm glad to see that this is all here. Encouraging people like, oh yes, this is a good thing as opposed to seeing the other um, signs that we usually see here in San Francisco that talk about like, oh, everyone's going to go to hell. I just believe that God loves everyone and I think that to pick and choose things from the Bible and use them against people is totally wrong. If Jesus says love everyone, then why would you choose to love certain people and not others? It's important to let everyone know that God loves them just the way they are. The church has done a tremendous amount of damage, especially over the last 30 years, telling people that God doesn't love them. Some people have actually been kicked out of church because of their sexual orientation or gender identity. I don't mean verbally told, simply to go, and that has happened. But some people physically have been picked up by their shirt collar and their belt loop and thrown out the door of churches. Because telling anybody but that they're going to hell or that what they live for is wrong is just evil. Nobody chooses the way that they come into the world or how they're raised or anything like that. And if God created them, then they are they were born that way. They were created by him and they're gonna be loved by him. Whenever I was uh, younger I got told I was going to hell, so that pretty much shows differently.